trailer from the storage compound here. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna break in here. Forever. Yeah, Glenn brought his green plates all the way out here to <laughs> clone. I bet you're excited, eh? Yes, I am. Sir. Yeah. I can't wait. Yeah. I, uh, Somewhere in here, there's a brand new trailer with Glenn's name on it. No, it doesn't have my name on it. It's got somebody else's name on it. Mm -hmm. So was it a horse trailer or a flat deck? It's what a, did you a get? Horse, it's a horse trailer with sleeping sleeping uh, accommodation. Oh, yeah. We won't really break in. We'll wait for the guy with the key, but yeah, then we'll... That's probably right. Yeah. There you go. Lights on. Glenn's home. Glenn's home. <laughs> <laughs> so he didn't get a hotel room. He's going to sleep in here, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, well, this is the first part, Trevor. This is the, this is the walk-in door. <laughs> this is yeah. the door and the light. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. 2.2 rims is a brand, brand, brand new. Oh, nice. Yeah. And actually, uh, 2021, they finally put a uh, grip on there. You could have lunch sitting on there. They're huge. That is awesome. Food. Look food at that. Yeah. Holy smokes. Yeah. And it won't ice up either. You got a nice yeah. lock on there. Slide right out of here. Oh boy, that new trailer feeling. All right. There we go. Drove all day, 12 hours on the road to get here. Yes. It's Dedication, fast. eh? Yeah. yeah. Thousand and eighty kilometers, right? Yeah. Yeah. Nice stop. There you go. Woo. Yeah. Holy, brand new boost loading in a brand new trailer. Isn't that awesome, huh? Oh, mission accomplished! Yeah, we got it done already. There she is, she's in the office. Right on. Ooh, hot, Heater's working? Yeah. That's what you bought this for was the heat, so. Yes. Oh, it's a uh, 75 45, 75 is the room, 25 is the shared between the room and the floor. Yeah, the floor. I'll show you the after, man. That's the system. So that's a, uh, as I say, insulated. Right, yeah. And then wing nuts either end. Which are uh, recent water, yeah? Nice stuff. Uh, you got one heated, here's your heated on the holder. Should be there. And then dry storage. Yeah. Yeah. These are uh, new for 20. Sweet. Okay, double lock right here. Right on. Yeah. There you have it. Sunrise Trailer Sales, West Kelowna. This one came out of Vancouver yesterday. Piss and rain. Good thing we're heading sledding. Definitely this will make sledding a little nicer now. Look at that. They have made one heck of a trailer here, that's for sure. Look at that, even got lights in the front. That'll be covered in road shit, but Glenn will pressure wash it off. None other than the Barant Special. Yeah, I'll show you at the back here just so you can see for yourself that all that money went to that guy. Ha! Nice work, Brandt. That is sweet. This has everything you could want for a snowmobiler, that's for sure. There's still some accessories you could spend a few thousand more on, I'm sure. And there you go. Brand new boost, zero miles. Sitting in it, ready to go. Ready to go. I don't know what Glenn's more excited about, the trailer or the boost. Guess we'll find out, eh? I don't think Glenn's even looked through it, but I think we better have a quick peek here and make sure. Check this out. See what's inside of here. Oh, ho, ho. yeah, there it is. It's got that turny thing there, so that's that's good news. It actually is a boost. Yeah. Never thought we would maybe see one of these this year. Never knew what was going on, but well, there they are. They have arrived. There it goes. There goes our happy camper, hey? There you go. He's off. Have a good one. Yeah, you too. Thanks a bunch, eh? Got a mobile shop on wheels. Fixing all those uh, defects on those new boosts. <laughs> Over and out.
have to figure out the stereo tomorrow. Sure. Or tonight. Oh, whatever. Get, get <laughs> someone like Leilani on that one. She'll have to figure it out in no time. So I think there's only... Cheers. I think there's only two things i found so far that are kind of... The caulking again. All the seams. And these front these front covers. I don't like them at all. Which covers? These wood covers on the on the spare tire. They put they got the spare tire yeah. under there, right? I already caught my foot on this once. Oh yeah. And once that gets wet and you catch your foot on that, it's just gonna start peeling, right? It's yeah. not sitting there good. So that's a problem and if you lift that hatch there, Glenn, the small one where the batteries are, that's all full of road grit. There's no grommet in that front hole there. That's oh, coming yeah. right off the road. Yeah. So that should have been foamed or caulked or whatever, but... Yeah, well look at all the shit in there already. Yeah, and the and the electrical wires are running right through on, a on, hole on, in the frame. On, yeah, there should be a, a grommet in there. Yep. And then silicone. Exactly. Yeah, shot of spray foam or whatever, keep everything sealed. Good idea for the spare tire. But I'm just not sure right now seeing this if uh, from a design perspective if having the spare tire in the floor is is gonna offset the value of having this big cutout oh. in the floor, right? Yeah. I just don't know. You guys should just take the spare tire, put it in the back of your truck, and the silicone is all shut. That's kind of what I'm thinking, yep. Yeah. I mean, that's exposed plywood, right? These floors, you don't want water getting in all these cracks and swelling up your plywood. Well, he said this is uh, well, he said in the PVC or something. Well, that's plywood. Yeah. Well, here we are in the shop. Hey, Glenn. Trevor, we got. Uh, one thing done here, we put the new heavy duty tree, uh, tree hugger bumper on. Perfect. The, uh, old, uh, old unit. Hang on to that, we might need that, eh? Yeah, we might yeah. need that back and put a new brand lock and tie bag. Yeah. So basically, you just pull the things, take her out. Take yeah, that's her slick. Nice and warm, dry her out, whatever. Or if you want to slam it off, just throw it in a snow bank. And Giver. So Perfect. Put on, bang, bang. And boom. Good. Nice solid. Yeah. And you get your spare belt put in and I gotta put the spare belt in here and yep. got the bumper all new. This is coming out here. A little more. I don't know how much uh, that'll stop me from hitting the tree, but Yeah. Well whatever. they're a little stronger, right? Hopefully you have yeah. less damage if you do. And then oh, it's got a, a piece that goes actually down that, the front here too. Mm -hmm. Get it pretty hard. Good. Yeah. Some of the some of the many things that you might want to put on a brand new sled, right? Yeah. Get it ready to go. Yes. We got now we got this custom wrap too that we're gonna start putting on here. So Absolutely. start working on this first panel and all customized from Arctic FX. Hey, get at her. Here. Let's get to work. And then have a shot. <laughs> oh yeah, I could use one now. Then I'd be drunk by no time. Well, just getting a couple pieces of the new uh, the new Cratch climbing all wrap here on the old boosts. It's looking pretty good, sir. Yeah, a couple black ones along. there. This this is all wrap. This is wrap. That's wrap. We're gonna black her out and bring a little yellow into it. So yellow and lime. purple. Some lime. Some lime. With like lime and all. Lime and all favorite flavor <laughs> and uh, yeah this is it all laid out here if anybody if you haven't done a wrap before it's like a mile long roll of stuff there and you just get to peel and stick how's it going there Trevor oh pretty good we're just going we're doing our heavy duty we've got the one side front all pretty much done we're just working on the right side now and a little bit more on the panel work and then a little bit more on that tunnel and I think we've got a gang bird just a nice day today, just to just relax and get everything going together. We're not rushed. Perfect. Thanks, Trevor, for uh, putting up with me and uh, <laughs> getting hey, this all done. Thanks for coming down to Kelowna. <laughs> wrap here, almost got the wrap all done. 
what the heck? There's, there's the diagram and the install instructions, like, rolled right in the middle of the roll, like the last thing you would even look at, so, uh, it's pretty funny. I can take a joke Arctic FX, but seriously, you guys should have that on the outside of the roll, so it's the first thing you look at when you open it up. Oh, well. Well, here we go. This is the last, the last two pieces, I guess. Isn't that sharp? It's like limeing all lightning. <laughs> How's the Arctic FX been so far, Glenn? Putting it on. Uh, actually, you know, it's, it was better than I thought. Uh, the biggest problem is finding where the pieces go. <laughs> That's right. The you big know, puzzle. Start sticking them on. Uh, you know, they give you a lot of grace. You can rip them off and put them back down and everything. It's, it's pretty good. As long as you keep her clean, eh? Yeah. Start with the top top line there. and yeah. I don't know if she's going to get much better than that. I'll have to make sure the other side gets on perfect. There she is, all wrapped up. Purple, Good yellow, Polaris. Good job, Glenn. Thanks for letting me do this. Uh, UDD drafting? Yep. UD2 and Ag Cam Farms. What a beauty. Oh. Yeah, it looks good. The show lights. Yeah. Little. <laughs> Dirty suspension. Awesome, Trevor. Good job. Let's go do something. Like that.